a scary, scary freaking place. There might be people out to get me right now, and there might be a bounty on my head from saying this information, but just know I love you guys, every single one of you, I love you. This shit right here, this shit, this shit, b bust it. Mm. Mm. To start the day, we got some frozen onion rings because I haven't heated them up yet, but they about to be busting too. I got some peppers and a, a steak on a sandwich, whatever that's called. I got some brown water because that shit busting too. That's just how you start the day, you know what I'm saying? Like anything, anything outside of this, like you're not in the right lane. If you don't go cross that while eating your food, but that's why. <laughs> and you don't get that little, like, you know what I'm saying? Like a little stuttering motion, like. <laughs> then your shit ain't even busting enough. Like, you, you ain't even, you know what I'm saying? You ain't getting the nutrition that you need. And while you have that brain aneurysm, you gotta be dancing. Your feet gotta be moving, you know what I'm saying? If your feet ain't moving like this while you while you eating, that shit ain't busting enough, cuz. Say hello to the vlog and the Duffies. Hi, vlog. Hey. Hi, Duffies. Yeah, that's why I call them Duffies one more time. Duffies. Hey, that's true love right there. <laughs> hey, okay. I got one question, one question <laughs> for you. What, what the shit are those? They're my sippies. What the shit are those? And you got socks on. The but. All right, the reason why I have the camera on, Ashley, I gotta tell you something that's, I just didn't really want to tell you, but now I gotta tell you. Shut up. Seriously. You got the smoothest brain I've ever seen. <laughs> Damn, oh sh my god. That shit is smooth. That shit is smooth. You got a smooth ass brain. What are we gonna do with you? Your brain is smooth. Do you even have like an IQ at all? Like what's going on? What's your what's your PR? Like what's your earnings? You got zero earnings? I don't even know what you're saying. You got zero earnings. Mean. You got no earnings. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this, but uh <laughs> There's, there's some stuff going on. It's not funny. Why are you, why are you, why are you laughing? So I've been trying to do it. What are you? She's not taking it serious. We just found out today. Ashley has a smooth brain. And to top it all up, Gigi has Zero, zero earnings. No freaking earnings and a smooth brain. I don't know what we can do about it. I don't know. Do not fear. The Duffies, we're gonna get you help, okay? We're gonna get you the best doctors they are, and we're gonna open your little skull, and we're gonna help your smooth brain. No way. Daddy Duff got some issues, cuz. I got like the worst back in my life. That's not the words I was looking for, but you know what I mean? I got like the worst pain in my back. And it's weird for me, I usually don't have like soreness. I don't know why, I don't really get like, you know, stiff necks or anything like that. So I got like a pain in the, in the center of my back, like on my spine, and also like my chest. Like it's like in the middle of my chest and my back. Oh my, you put a finger in my butt. Like, that's, that's crazy. Why would you ever do that in your life? Don't ever do that again. You sus, boy. You sus, boy. No, you put your finger in my butt. Don't do that again. You sus, boy. Uh, step on my back. Okay, put my bougie slippers on. Oh my god, this is gonna be crazy. Oh, should we get paralyzed and paraplegic? Oh, no, up, up higher, up higher, higher. Up. Well, I gotta put two feet on okay, you. Okay, okay, sorry. Oh, oh god. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, 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 Nothing. 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 Nothing, man. Damn, I can stop <laughs> putting your finger in my butt. Damn. <laughs> What is wrong with you? You freaking smoothest brain I've ever seen in my life. It's good. Yo, today's crazy day. Crazy day. And I'm about to tell the OG Duffy's why. First of all, if you don't know who this sex beast is, my name is Jake Duffner. Every single day, we upload nothing but bangers. But guys, there's some nostalgia that is going to be in today's vlog. And you're going to find out why in a second. It's kind of heartbreaking to me. Probably going to be heartbreaking to most of you guys. But it is what it is. It's got to be done, and I'll explain why in a second. First things first, you got to say hi to my man, Marsh. Hi, Marshy. And, of course, Mil Mil. Hi, Mil Mil. Your daddy's baby is girl today? Yes, you are. And daddy's baby boy right here. Mm-hmm. Okay, guys. Ashley's not here right now, and this is what I really want to tell you guys. Ashley? 
All right, she's in the bathroom right now, which is perfect. Just wondering, never mind. So my last video you guys all saw about a little girl that we found locked inside of an abandoned house cabin. At the end of the video, it was very, very disturbing, the information that this little girl told us. We instantly took her to the police station, and we dropped her off. I told the cops everything that happened. The cops saw the footage, and the cops highly, highly suggested that I do not speak of this or talk to the camera and vlog about it. Ashley's super uptight about it, and she does not want me to be talking about it or filming about it right now. But there's no way I'm about to just act like nothing ever happened, so I'm telling you guys, because you guys are the family and you're the Duffy. We dropped that little girl off at the police station the other night. I don't know her real name or how old she is or anything like that. The cops literally wouldn't tell me anything, but I do know that she was involved in a human trafficking scheme. I gotta go outside real quick to finish this. Yeah. Ugh. Hi, Mr. Jeep. Hi, Mr. Jake and little camera. See ya. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, the Mr. Beast right here. I'll go in the race car today. It's all blacked out, too. <sighs> nice. Haven't been in this bad boy in a flat minute. Yo, I'm gonna start it up, actually, for you guys. Might as well. I got the key right in here. Hold on one second. I'll get back to my story in a second. Come on, baby. Come on. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go! I freaking highly doubt unless Ashley is Aqua one in and has 17 tentacles with senses and ears all over her foreheads and stuff. She's not hearing me right now. I got a race car blaring with a 2JZ with a giant turbo. So I can probably yell and she wouldn't hear me, which is great. Like I was saying, that little girl was involved in a human trafficking scheme. There's underground tunnels. That little tunnel that you guys saw trying to open, underneath there, there's like tunnels, I guess it's a sewage drain, and they would just transfer girls back and forth between houses. The world is a freaking scary place. It is such a scary place. Please be safe out there, If you're, if, especially if you're young. Recently, a UPS truck was just pulled over. I don't remember the state that it was in, but I remember seeing the article. A UPS truck was pulled over, and the cop opened up the back of the UPS truck to literally like 10 or 20 different kids in the back all curled up tied up they were trafficking more kids throughout the United States guys this is scary this is very freaking real there is human trafficking going on all around you there is kids being abducted every single day there is kids that are taken from their family taken from their homes and they're being kidnapped and tortured and sexually abused it is scary stuff this is not fake this is not me making it dramatic for youtube this is 100 percent legit please do research look it up on google google might be censoring a lot of your stuff it might be hard to find it on google try to find a third party app that doesn't censor your search engine but guys i'm risking my life on camera for you guys to make a difference in this world and to spread awareness I see somebody, hold on. Somebody's literally standing behind my car. Look at that guy right there. What are you doing? Look at him, he's getting back in his car. He doesn't even live there. I know all my neighbors and he does not live there. I caught you red handed, bro. Look, now he's on his phone. He's talking around, he's walking, he's walking away. What the hell? This guy was just standing behind my driveway, taking photos of me and stuff. Now he's walking away. He, he just acted like he was getting mail from that mailbox. He saw I was looking at him probably and just started walking away. Look, now he's running? He just literally ran away, bro. What the hell? This is what I'm trying to say, yo. This is what I'm trying to say. They don't want you knowing this information. I don't know who's trying to get me, who's behind me, the elites. I don't know if it's the government. I don't know if it's the mafia. I don't know what it is, but somebody is watching my videos and somebody is, knows that I know too much information and I'm finding too much stuff out and they don't want me speaking. I refuse to close my mouth. I'm going to end up dying from this stuff and just make sure that they, these videos are all downloaded and saved because I don't want Google taking these videos down. I, I need the word to get out there, yo. The world is run by pedophiles human trafficking they are sacrificing young kids lives for their benefits for their talking to Satan for their satanic rituals their greed and fortune they're selling kids on the internet they're they're dis they're distributing kids all over the United States for money and power that is how corrupt things are coming in this United States I know that the police told me not to speak on the situation of the girl that we just found yesterday police if you're seeing this I'm sorry it's just it's nothing against you and I don't want to disrespect you guys because you guys did help out the girl a lot I know that 
my wife, if she's seeing this, is gonna be very freaking mad that I'm speaking upon this because I was distinctly told to do not speak on this, but there's no way I'm gonna stay in silent. There's just no way. I am on to something freaking huge. We are on to something freaking huge. I don't care if I end up dying from this. As long as it makes a huge impact on this world, it makes the world a better place. Look, I got the chills talking about it. It's just, it's a scary, scary freaking place. There might be people out to get me right now, and there might be a bounty on my head from saying this information, but just know I love you guys, every single one of you. I love you so freaking much. The family that we created, the journey that we went through together since the day I picked up a camera and, and made a YouTube video, 2017, that was freaking four years ago. Ever since that day, you guys really helped me and changed my life, and I love you, every single one of you for that. So if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and join the family, join the Duffies. It's it's definitely gonna be different on this channel than any other channel you've seen before. So I'm glad that if you're new, you're here, and you're here to stay. Love you. I love you. Yeah, baby. We got some smoked steak coming in tonight. We got the charcoal cooking up right now. We got some New York strip steak right here. Welcome to Jake Duffner's cooking show. We put a bunch of meat in your mouth. Can you suck on the meat, nice juicy meat. There's, there's helicopters going, my dogs are fighting. I just wanna film my cooking show. Like what the hell is going on, Jesus. But anyways, we got some nice juicy fat meat right there. Just how I like it. By the way, I didn't wash my hands today, so Good. that's that. Good stuff. Then lay that right there. Ooh, that sizzle. We got the big daddy one. This one's for me. Mm. Boom, baby. We're gonna get some hamburgers and hot dogs for Millie too. What are you doing licking that? Don't lick that. <gasps> Don't eat that, baby. That's gross. So even though we are living in an old serial killer's house, I pick up the ca every time I pick up the camera, there's something going. Now we got power saws going over there. But yeah, even though we live in an old serial killer's house, we try our best to make it like home-like because even though we're not gonna be here forever, we're probably gonna sell it in a little bit. Uh, we got it's our home, you know what I mean? So we got some steaks cooking up in the backyard. Look at it go. That's what I like to see right there, dude. That looks so good. Yo, I can't wait to shove that meat down my throat. All right, guys, so as you can see, I like mine a little bit well done. Uh, <laughs> Ew, that thing is a brick. <laughs> for some reason, it looks like that, but the inside is still raw. <laughs> because he put it in the fire. I'm a man, I can eat it like that. Oh my God. <laughs> I think this one's gonna start to be cooked in a second. <laughs> I'm eating bricks tonight for dinner. Mm. Mine's over here chilling. Oh, Wait, yours he is also a brick. Yeah, so pretty much uh, Jake Duffer's cooking show. We cook bricks. <laughs> After I completely ruined my steaks, I still ate it by the way, because like I'm a caveman at heart. <laughs> Me and my best friend Brad growing up, we used to just like throw meat in like fire and eat it. We used to walk around barefoot and stuff. I'm a caveman at heart, but I just made burgers. Also burned the crap out of them, but nothing, some hot sauce won't do to fix it. Today's a beautiful night, man. Mm -hmm. Beautiful night. I got smoke blaring me in the face. Mm -hmm. I got some charcoal on a bun with some hot sauce. Mm, can't beat it, baby. Yo, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one. I love you guys, and uh, we'll keep you updated. Make sure you subscribe. Love you, deuces. Yeah.